Hello, so like, this is how I do my homework. Um, usually I do like big projects last minute. Like this one, I have to do like all of this. So, you know, like I have to kind of create a book. This is my textbook. It's like, can you see it? Oh, it's like, that's my textbook. And then, wait, what am I doing? This is my textbook. Wait, what am I doing? Oh my god. Okay, sorry. I did it upside down. So, and then I do easier stuff after the big stuff. So, like, this project is due on Friday and today is Wednesday. I do math after, usually. And then last is usually, like, ELA and stuff. Or should I say benchmark? So. <sighs> Pencil, paper, binder to lay down, and yeah. So I just do it, and then when I'm done with the first page, you can. I'll just like read it out to you. So. Okay, so like, I will. Like, I already completed one. And like this so after I finish then like you know you'll see that so yeah you could so right now I'm learning about ancient India like ancient civilizations so yeah that's the fact about today ancient India Fun time. Do 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 do. Okay, so like I finished one page now. This is what I wrote. I wrote. So, page one, Hinduism. Hinduism was a popular religion in ancient India and still is today. Hindus believe in many deities and three major deities, Brahma, Brahma, Shiva, and Vishnu. According to Hindu teachings, everyone has a soul or Atman inside them. Hindus believe that our souls will eventually join Brahman because the world is a part of Brahman, and we live in an illusion. It is hard to see through an illusion, so it'll take several lifetimes, and each time with a different body. This is called the incarnation. Okay, that's page one. Like, these things are very short. This thing is just page one, so yeah. Page number two, Buddhism. The founder of Buddhism is Siddhartha, Gautama, or the Buddha. The Buddha left his home to find answers to his questions. He started fasting and devoting a lot of time for meditation. After seven weeks of meditation, he had ideas and by the age of 35 started to teach others his ideas. Buddhism rejected many ideas in, in the Vedas and the Buddha challenged the authority of priests. After the Buddha died, according to the Buddhist tradition, 500 followers met to make sure the Buddha's, Buddha's teachings were correctly remembered. After 200 years of his death, his teachings spread throughout most of India. So like this is in ancient India around... Around five in around the five hundreds, like the five hundreds BC, so like before Christ, so like yeah, five hundred years before they started counting. So I've been like yeah. So now I'm done with that part, and now I'm going to start not this, but another page, which is blank. Uh, okay, let's start.
but time for fun time. Fun time. Hi. I want to say one thing. Fun time. Sorry, let's start. Let us start. Okay. Time for page three and four. Okay, just a rest. Today is for winner. This will probably be the best page in the book. So what am I supposed to be? What is page three supposed to be about? It's supposed to be about the caste system. Okay. Wait, is it about the caste system? Yes, it is. Okay. Let me see. Cast system. C A S T space S Y S T E M. Okay. Now it's time to. Okay, so I guess I finished. Page three, which is the caste system. It is this caste system. The caste system had four main varnas, according to the Vedas. The highest varna were the priests or brahmins. Then second highest varna. Uh, then the second. Then second highest varna. Oh, no, mistake. Wait, is it varna or varna? Varna. The second highest point I was okay, let me restart. Caste system. The caste system had four main violence. Oh my gosh, I'm slipping. Okay. Caste system. The caste system had four main violence according to the Vedas. The highest varna were the priests or Brahmins. The second highest varna were the Kshatriyas. Or warriors and rulers. The second to last one is the farmers, class, class people, and traders, known as the Vaishyas. Vaishyas, I don't know. The last one are the Sudras, or the workers and servants. There were strict rules for the caste system. People could not marry, eat with the people from different ta- castes, and more. People who broke the rules would be banned from their castes, which would make them unspeakables. So that's like. See, now let me see the number four. Yeah. Oh, I'm sorry, it's time to sleep. Well, I'm sorry, I'll work, uh, I'll work on this tomorrow. I have one more day left. And thank you for watching. I really appreciate it. And yeah, I'm just going to like wake up tomorrow in the morning and do my math. I might get late and then like tomorrow is the last day. Well, stay in tune for more and see if I get a good grade or not. What should I name this? How about. I have no idea. Well, stay tuned for more.